Editing objects. To run functions with the IP control center, objects and group addresses are required. The IPCC provides a total of 1250 of these addresses. These are processed in two different blocks. 250 objects are created directly in the parameter settings of ETS and more up to 1000 are exported via an OPC data exchange from ETS and by means of ESF import imported into the IPCC. The generation and configuration of the 250 objects in ETS will now be shown with an example. The up to 1000 additional addresses we will discuss later in this WBT. The first objects of the IPCC have already been defined by the previously discussed general settings. These include device status, date, time and scene function. The list of objects therefore starts at number 6 and ends at 255. In each case five functions are grouped into a collection. In each function three parameters must be edited. In object number an eight character description text can be entered. Despite its brevity the text description should be used anyway for example by a sensible abbreviation in order to recognize the object later in the IPCC's editor. Using the later described OPC export the short texts can then be replaced in the IPCC by the identifier of the sending group address in the particular object. We call our first object li underscore a underscore s which stands for light a switching. Second we set the data type. Here it is of course one bit because we want to switch the light on and off. You can generally select all important data types with the exception of 4 bit dimming and time date we have already under general. Pay close attention with the analog DPTs to use the correct sign option or the floating point representation. Because the specifications contained herein can't be changed anymore later in the IPCC. Last, it is determined whether the object is to be updated after a restart of the IPCC by polling. The option Yes is only useful if the sending address of the object is a readable status. That's not true with a simple switching function. So we choose here at Enable read on init No.